so each one of the pieces of t-shirt that you just cut is going to have a side seam. We're just going to take those pieces and cut that side seam right out of there. Take your piece of t-shirt material and you're going to want to give it a pull so it rolls in on itself to make your tie straps. And repeat for the other one. You'll see the t-shirt kind of curl and that's what you want. So grab your bandana. You're going to fold up the end about three inches. Go to the opposite side and fold it up about three inches. Take that edge, fold it towards the center. The opposite edge, fold it almost all the way down to meet this other edge. Give it a press with your hands. Take that bandana and you're gonna fold it in four or five inches on the one side. Grab the other side and you're gonna open up that bandana so you have this little pocket and you're gonna take the opposite side and you're gonna feed it in to that side of the bandana. Okay, so now I just finished showing you how to fold the bandana to make the face mask, the size that you need to cut your t-shirt ties into, and now I'm gonna show you how to put it on. I've had a lot of comments in my other videos saying that these masks only stay up on my head because I have a ponytail in. So I thought today I would demonstrate how to put this on and how to tie it without having a ponytail so that you can see that these fit my head really well, that they do stay up in place and it has nothing to do with how my hair is styled. So go ahead and take your bandana with your t-shirt tie slipped through the hole and you're gonna take it so the folded area is facing out away from you. Take the loop of the tie and you're gonna slip this part over your head. Make sure that the tie is resting up against the back of your neck and then you're gonna take the two loose ends of the tie. You're gonna hang on to those while you shift the bandana up close to your face. Then with one tie in each one of your hands, you're gonna pull the bandana up over your face. And as you do that, you're gonna pull the ties out to the side to begin to tighten the side of the mask. So it starts to kind of scrunch down like a normal face mask. Take the ties and you're gonna tie them up onto the upper part of your head and pull it so it's pretty secure. The great thing about using t-shirt material for a tie is that it's got some elasticity to it. It's comfortable to wear on your head and it's gonna help provide a really good fit for your face mask. So that's just how simple it is to get this mask fitted to your face properly. As you can see, it sits up high on the neck here. It's tied up top, it's not shifting around. Um, I don't have a ponytail in, so it's staying up on my head without that. It's comfortable to wear, and the great thing about this is the tie is reusable and washable, and so is the bandana. So I hope this little tutorial cleared up any um, questions that you guys may have had about how I personally tie my face masks, especially my no-sew face masks. Um, as you can see, I didn't have a ponytail in. The mask stays up. It's comfortable to wear and it fits my head properly. But please do whatever um, works best for you, works best for your family, um, because that's really gonna provide the most comfortable fit. So I hope you guys found this helpful. Um, give it a like, make a comment down below if there's anything else that you would like to see or any more questions that you have. Um, but I hope you are all well and staying safe and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.